Want to upgrade your content from something like this to something a little more like this? I'm going to show you how using the Avermedia Extreme Cap BU110 capture card. The Extreme Cap is a UVC capture card that can record uncompressed 1080p video. What makes this device unique is that it doesn't have an HDMI pass through like other cards from Avermedia. This makes the Extreme Cap a perfect choice to connect with a DSLR camera. Before we get started, there are a few things you may want to consider if you plan to use your Extreme Cap with a DSLR camera. The first thing you'll want to do is determine if your camera has an auto shutoff feature, and more importantly, if this feature can be disabled. Not all cameras have an auto shutoff feature, but if your camera does, you will want to make sure that it's off to prevent the camera from powering off while you're recording or streaming. You should also confirm that your camera supports an output via HDMI up to a maximum of 1080p. The next thing that you'll want to confirm is whether or not your camera has a clean HDMI output like this. Some cameras may display information about your video, like video quality, the brightness histogram, or even a focusing reticle on the LCD screen on the camera. Sometimes those overlays are transferred to the HDMI output. You'll want to look in your settings to confirm that you can get a clean HDMI output, otherwise your footage may end up looking like this. The last thing you'll want to consider is providing continuous power to your camera while it's in use. While you can rely on DSLR batteries, your record and stream time may be limited when doing so. Look into an option like a dummy battery or an AC power adapter for your camera. The Extreme Cap supports both USB 3.0 and USB 2.0. If you have the port available, we recommend using a USB 3.0 port for reduced latency. You can also use your own USB Type-C cable if you have an open USB Type-C port in your computer. Also, as a UVC device, the Extreme Cap will work with Windows, Mac OS, and Linux. Connecting your Extreme Cap is simple. On one side, you have a USB Type-C port and on the other side, you have an HDMI in port. We've already connected the included USB cable to our computer, so now we're going to plug in the Extreme Cap. You will notice that the light will turn on, but it's red for now to indicate that we're not ready. Now we need to connect our DSLR camera to our Extreme Cap. Connect one end of the HDMI cable into your Extreme Cap and the other end into your DSLR camera. After you've connected the HDMI cable, the light on the Extreme Cap should change from red to blue. Please keep in mind that not all cameras have the same size HDMI output, so you may need to find an HDMI adapter. Consult your camera's manual to confirm what you'll need to use it with an Extreme Cap. Now that our device is connected, we can set it up in our favorite video capture or streaming software. In this case, we're using OBS. Start by adding the Extreme Cap UVC as a video capture device. For best results, we recommend that you download and install the Avermedia Stream Engine and select that option in the list. You will notice that your source should change from a 4x3 ratio to a 16x9 ratio. That's it! You can now start streaming and recording with your DSLR camera and the Extreme Cap BU110.